Oh god. Don't be stunned. Make sure no one's behind us. Okay, good. Hello, friends, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die with your host, Rongo the Bold. So, we have been very lucky lately. We got our... In the last couple episodes, we've got an auger, we got a nail gun, a chainsaw, and our sniper rifle. It is like epic loot time of epic, epic town. So, very excited about this, and we are now ready to begin construction of our underground bunker base. Um, so, it's going to be today, I'm going to do a lot of augering. Um, I did have, we had seven oil barrels, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and break those down into gas cans. So we got 42 gas cans, 43 total, which is pretty decent. That will, uh, that'll keep us going for a bit. Now, augering is a little noisy. I do think I've got the thing game audio balanced decently, so hopefully it won't be too loud for you guys. Um, but I think showing you guys the augering is always fun. But before we do that, I just want to make a huge shout out to everyone. A uh, huge thanks. Uh, I just successfully completed my first subscriber uh, event this weekend, January 3rd, uh, 2015. We had an open server set up uh, and invited uh, all of you wonderful subscribers to come join me. We had, I think, I had 11 people that I counted um, who joined in the game throughout the day. And it ran, wow, uh eight and a half to like 11 and a half hours or so um so it was a lot of seven days to die my fingers were tired i uh yeah, this is the, this is the sunday after and i spent uh <laughs> the morning just relaxing watching some youtube video just chilling having breakfast before i'm like okay i need to get some solo gameplay episodes recorded so it was nice to, uh, it was really nice to play with everybody. Um, big shout out to all the people who joined me. Um, I can't remember everyone's handles off, offhand. I should have made a note of that. Maybe I'll go back and do that later on. But I know the Victorian Dad, uh, Space Frace, um, uh, McHaggis, uh, I know Thunderfoot, uh, Thunderlord2200. I can't remember what his gamer's hag was. Uh, big shout out to Bryhan35, who died the most to spike related deaths. Um, he got caught in a spiral and got his wellness down to 30 and every time he plays the spike he would just die again. So I feel a big shout out to that guy. He he deserves he deserves a round of applause for taking one for the team. Um, I, I'm gonna be posting all of those. Uh, I, I basically, I didn't get the morning recorded the morning we started off in the city hub and it was brutal. Uh, not only just the number of zombies, but the lag. Um, we had, I think at that time we had like six or seven people playing and, um, we all met up in an apartment building, but it was so laggy. We were getting like nine to 15 frames a second. So we decided to move out of the city and, uh, raid it later on instead. And we moved to a forest biome just to the Northwest of the city and we set up a base and it was amazing. We did have some some help. I put out some crates early on with some supplies and things kind of scattered around, and people found those. So we had a good set of supplies to start off with, but uh, we threw together a concrete fortress really quick. And then over the next, um, you know, eight hours, we built an amazing base. And that all that video will be posted. Uh, I recorded all of it, and um, just gonna do a little bit of a little bit of post processing on it. Adding a you know intro bit and some text and trimming them down to fit a reasonable size. They're all going to be like hour long videos, so they're a lot. They're, I mean, it was just a lot of content. So rather than uh, piecemeal out in fifteen minute chunks, I'm just going to dump it out there in hour long segments. And I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, I do think what was that? oh that fire just burned out. I'm like what did the torch go out or something? What the hell? Um, anyway, I, I really enjoyed that, and we are definitely going to be doing a second one. Um, everyone who played seemed to really enjoy themselves. Got a lot of great feedback, uh, a lot of good viewers on Twitch. So uh, next time I'm going to promote it a little better, and uh, I think we'll probably do some sort of challenge 
Like, uh, I, I'm still debating that, but if you have ideas for challenges, I know, like, some other YouTube Let's Players for Seven Days do, like, a, a hunting, uh, um, uh, hunting games. What am I trying to think of? What's that stupid game? Hunger Games. <laughs> Hunger Games uh, style thing. Uh, but uh, if you guys have ideas of, of what kind of really cool event we could do with uh, eight players on the server for a day, let me know and uh, I'll see if we can organize that. Uh, we had people from all over the world playing, from, from the UK, from farther east in Europe, um, all the way through uh, the United States. So I just just a great time was had by all. Uh, next time we'll also have uh, audio. So we'll do probably either a, a Skype or Google Hangout or something like that for audio. So anyway, just a huge shout out. Thanks so much for watching, participating, for being part of the community. We also today, we broke 300 subscribers, which is just amazing. Uh, when I started this channel, I started it kind of on a whim, just just to share my enjoyment of this game with others and to show, show my enjoyment of just all the other games I play with everybody else. And uh, you guys have responded. So thank you so much. And with that, let's get augering. So I'm basically going to be building a big cavern, and I'll be building a base inside this cavern underground. So uh, there's a lot of material that I want to mine out of here. Um, so I'm not going to make you guys watch a lot of it. I'll, I'll probably, you know, I'll do cuts here and there, and as I get the mining bin, but done. But I'll basically be mining all day, get this going. Uh, I'll check upstairs uh, how our crops are doing, um, and... Probably tomorrow we'll need to go get some dirt and expand our farm a bit. So that's all to come. But for now, plug your ears. We're going in. gas already we're gonna need to get some corn going so we can get some fuel for that oh i'm sense really <laughs> silly zombies gotta get those pieces that are a little farther away all right that's enough for that part Try and make a, just a nice big, big cavern. Heavy. Kind of I want to make it kind of organic in a way too. I will need to take uh, regular breaks here today to uh, heal myself because where did I put my first aid kits up here, right? Yeah, because um, rocks fall on you once in a while. <laughs> And rocks are bad. <laughs> okay, I've hit the uh, ceiling here. Or I've actually hit clay. I don't want to go that high, so I'm going to put some rock back. Just to uh, seal up those areas, basically. I don't want to go... I don't want to be that exposed. So that'll be the, the highest I go up, right there. Look how much work I've gotten taking care of it's just so quickly. Oop. Thought I didn't pick up. All right, back to work. We've got a uh, supply drop just came overhead. I'm gonna go head up and see if I can do it. 
it was a good time to check our check out anything else is going. Uh, zombies have been very grumpy with me so far today. Oh, hello! What are you doing up here, zombie? There it is. We can get a beat on it before it goes down. It's on a road, which is good. Yeah, it looks about good. I am hunted. Uh, I know the zombies have been very grumpy with me today. So I think let's go down really quick. Uh, we've been doing some really good collecting of ores. I mean, look at that. Look at that ore we've gotten so far. So, yeah, we've been doing good. Let's uh, draw these zombies away from the house a little bit. We need to get... We need to get... Holy moly, they've been upset. Holy moly. Oh god. Don't be stunned. Make sure no one's behind us. Okay, good. Whoa! Let's get out of here. Let's get outside. Let's get outside. Oof. Okay. Uh, let's just do this really fast. Yeah, they don't like me making all that noise. They get very grumpy with me. But you know how we handle grumpy, grumpy zombies? We kill them. Oh yes. Man, we've got to finish hardening this base up. We gotta put a lip up there, definitely. They're taking it out. They're taking their anger out in this house next door. Are they upstairs? Well, for now, let's just go pick up this. Uh, let's pick up this supply drop. We need more goodies. A rabbit. I'm not worried about you. All right. Yeah. So so digging is going well. Um, I'm kind of evolving in my mind what I want the final shape to be like. What I'm looking for is kind of a big open cavern with a couple of levels in it. And then I'll build platforms rather than rooms on each level, which will... Hello, zombie. Which will allow me to have a really nice open, kind of open floor plan, multi-level uh, type, uh, type environment. Um, it can be cool. So let's see if we can spot this. I also want a swimming pool at the bottom. So I need to make a uh, a bucket at some point so we can go collect water. Okay, so I thought it was right around here. Oh, I'm thirsty. I did bring fluids, right? Yes, good. All right, let's take a look. Hmm. Do you guys see it? Am I looking right past it or what? Let's run up on this hill. It might give us a better viewpoint. I think I... It didn't look like it was that far, so... I don't want to run out too far and miss it, so let's just take a look. Oh, we're really close to that. Whoa, that was close. Yeah, I really should have bought a bucket today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't be bothered to kill you. You're beneath me. 
I don't think it fell across. I'm hoping to see it kind of backlit on the horizon. Oh, hold on. Is that it right there? Just across the biome switch? Looks to be. Like that for the metal. Yeah, I really should have. Should have brought a couple things. I want to bring a, a chainsaw over and collect a bunch of of uh, law of trees and I need to bring get some dirt and water so yeah tomorrow we'll come right back here and we'll do exactly that there it is SMG receiver which I already have iron helmet schematic I think we already have and divers I know we've got uh, but oh but I have the recipe now installed fixed added modified that I can put the thing right there what? I had the recipe right there. I swear. Okay, well. Something changed my recipes file. I already know that. Okay. Well, that's kind of a waste. Kind of a waste. Uh, is there anything else while we're out here? Maybe we kind of get to get all pigs if we can. I've got so many eggs. I just need like 20 pigs or 20 pig flushes. So let's do just a little bit of hunting. You know, the the, the mining is fun, but it definitely gets a little, a little tiring. I think our wellness is over 80 now. Rabbit. Rabbits we see all the time. I don't want you, rabbit. I want a pig. Ooh, a deer will do. Deer will definitely um, I don't need the flesh. I'm not worried about the gore blocks over here because it's so far from my zone that Alright, let's just look for look for pigs and deer. That's what we're hunting for. Because right now we're just surviving on grilled rabbit, which is tasty enough, uh, until our farm really takes off. I don't want to boil up our eggs yet. I really, I'm really, i really kind of holding out for piggy. But again, nice shot on the deer. There's another one right there. A lot of deer. I have to kill a few zombies here. With my deer. Ah, uh, you're getting close. Not close enough. Whoa! I I ducked. <laughs> Keep an eye on time. I've been playing so much on multiplayer, the time's been going by so slow that uh, I'm, I'm kind of been lulled into a sense that I've got all day. But if you think that, that we headed out just after noon at 12.30 and it's already almost 5. Or almost 3. Yeah, it's only been 3 hours. Time, Rongo. Time. Come on, piggies. <sighs> mm, I need something to eat and then bring a thing to eat. Alright. Let's look for some bags too. Just so I can move up the land a little bit. Move up the looting, I mean. It's a nice little river valley kind of thing. And you guys going to be happy? I'm not going to be picking up any more rocks. 
because I have so much stone now. It's ridiculous. Oh, that's really cool. I like this. Nice little meadow lake combo thingy. Glen. A Melvin. What we'll call this a Melvin? Hey, nurse. I could use another beaker. Oh. Hello. That was a waste of three bullets. Oh, perfect! <laughs> wow, I am just... Ah. I need to say things more often. I really, you know... I could use a fully working automobile right over here. Nope. I could use an Apache helicopter over here. Uh, it must have just flown away. Did I kill all the deer that live in this biome now? And are there no, are there no pigs? Oh, a little uh, a little hordy action going on. We'll just avoid that. And I am hungry now. Let's see if we can find a backpack or a purse. Usually along the roads is the best place. Okay, I heard a pig. Hmm. My A key is not, uh, it's not behaving very well. It's like, like, yeah, going one way or the other is faster. It's weird. I'll have to kind of keep that in mind. Oh, I like that cliff face. It's nice. Ooh, ooh. Oh wait, have I? Have I been here? Oh crap! I've been here. <laughs> Um, all right, let's, uh, start heading home. It's getting, it's getting on toward dusk. And we've already been in these areas. Even though we, you know, I'll take it. I'm going to put that, uh, hide in my hot bar that way when I pick a pig or anything else it won't drop into my hot bar it'll drop right into uh, inventory which will minimize the stink a little bit you have to be it's uh the range at which they can smell you is different between come on food oh perfect all right let's just uh that Eat that and uh, take these. All right, let's put the uh, auger back out here. All right, actually, sniper rifle out there ready. Okay, it sounded like it was right headed. There he is. Here we go, piggy, piggy, piggy. All right. Oh, loose. The, hey, you know, the supply drop was kind of meh since we already had the SMG parts and uh, already knew the books, which makes. Oops, but we are getting some good food. A day of hunting. Okay, where were you, Piggy? Where is it? Okay, it's gotta be right ahead of me. Squeal, Piggy! Squeal! Looking for movement.
Hmm. All right. Well, let's see. Okay. Definitely, he's definitely ahead of keep. Keep your squealing, piggy. There you are. You're even dead. Thank you. I don't know what you died of. Holy moly, that was a good haul. All right. Uh, I'm going to head directly home now. It is time. Time is ticking by. The late day is getting old. I kind of want more oil for weapon repair kits. All right, we will be back. Um, you know what? What can I drop? I can drop this. And I can drop... Oh. I can drop these pipes. What am I going to do? Really quickly. Just grab some wood. Walk well, here. I'm also going to grab some dirt. Okay, I'm going to kill some zombies. Don't need any of that stuff. Give us up a little more distance here. gonna run around real quickly here it's actually this is fast as the chainsaw take, 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 take down trees so the zombies are gonna be all pissed off right now nurse because I'm nurse prejudiced. Kill us pig because because pigs. Wow, oh, I'm getting long in the episodes. I'm hungry too. Alright, just a what am I doing for 41 logs, 24 dirt. Whoa! She scared me. She scared me the frick out. Okay, I'll check, 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 check. Okay, so that's all the wood we can haul. I'm going to run up here, we'll grab some more dirt. It's definitely the biggest, fastest way to do any kind of trenching work is to use a, use an auger. It's also a little nerve wracking because zombies are everywhere. And they all want to kill me. Time wise, 60 dirts. Let's get four more dirts and we'll call it good. Nerve wracking. Okay, that's all the dirt we need. 
All right, we can hold. All right, home, home, home. All right, friends. Well, that should just about wrap up this episode. Uh, again, I want to make a big, huge thank you to everyone who participated in this in the event this weekend. There will be others. If you missed out, don't worry. Your chance will come. And uh, uh, yeah, just really enjoyed it. Really enjoyed the friend, the the all the friendly banter. And next time I second set up, we are going to have audio to make it a little more, a little more. Uh, proactive and I'm going to try and come up with some ideas but if you guys have ideas of things we should try please let me know in comments here or on any of the community videos which I'll be posting over the course of this week it just takes a little while to process all that stuff but it was fun and I'm also just completely stoked that I now have over 300 subscribers so a big thank you to everyone who has been subscribing and watching my videos. Keep up the good work. Remember, if you like this video, click the like button, comment, subscribe, tell your friends, your family, and most importantly, tell your grandmother. And I will see you guys tomorrow.